Florida's oldest living gopher tortoise is celebrating a milestone today. That, did we speed go. that video? We're speeding I think it. we sped that up a little bit. Did 10 we? Tampa Bay photojournalist Tim Burquist shows you what makes Gus the tortoise such a legend. Party one was great. Uh, we had lots of enthusiastic uh, gopher tortoise lovers. Gus was purchased in the early 1940s. Ross Allen was the place that, that we bought it from. He was bought for $5. Uh, and brought back to Halifax. He has been you know, grown in popularity to become arguably the most popular part of the Nova Scotia Museum of Natural History. Gus has a fairly controlled diet. He, he tends to eat lettuce, uh, blueberries, and bananas. He's sort of well studied by tortoise experts around the world who are interested in his longevity. Well, in the wild, uh, most gopher tortoises generally live to be around 60. It's more man-made incursion that causes harm to gopher tortoises, whether it's development or car strikes. Those tend to be the things that shorten a gopher tortoise's life. We got the best deal that you can get for $5. He's been an incredible ambassador for the museum. I think he's been an incredible ambassador for, uh, for nature in general. And I think at some level, people want sort of inspirational characters who live long lives and impact lots of people and you know, I think that if he can be that for many people, I think that's wonderful as well. Gus is awesome. Wow. And that was him. And so, moving. yeah, for the record, that video like, was not sped up. Yeah. He was moving. I mean, he's 100 and he moves faster than me. <laughs>